Hey guys, Dr. Francis here, back with some more Grand Tactician and a new playthrough. So I said we were going to do a, a Confederate playthrough. Just with Historic, see how the AI can react for the Union. This is my initial setup. Difficulty very hard, bonus at uh, plus 25. And we're going to start in the Spring 1861 campaign. Then we'll kind of bounce around and do some new stuff. Uh, back to an 1862, maybe an 1863 campaign. But I want to compare how this one kind of does with the Union one we just had. It's going to be more of a chillax uh, playthrough, more than likely. We're going to play defensive, uh, but not like massively defensive. So we're going we're to see what the AI does. Do. One of the biggest issues is the forts down the south for the Confederate AI. They didn't really take those, and uh, we shouldn't have a lot of those issues for us. So we'll kind of see how that goes. Uh, we don't have any forts here. The forts that we did have was at up here and... Be right here so we, we're gonna get some forts together kind of how we'll do things let's get militia act one um i do want some i think we're gonna make sure we don't have any issues in funding we're gonna go funding after this Jefferson Davis is inaugurated. We're going to kind of put our commanders how they were in 1862 because I do want to test a couple things with that. I want to test Lee. I want to kind of test all that stuff. Loyalties in Missouri. Ducky Vows remain neutral. And we'll kind of see if this bug kind of goes again. Which is the bug that forced some odd things to happen on the menu screen. If that affects stuff. I'm not sure if I'm on a new update from uh, uh, 9010. Probably at this point. Okay, Lincoln is inaugurated. Is March fourth. Okay. The first thing we're going to do is Fort Sumter and Fort Pickens. They're kind of the first two things that we're going to do. This is March 14th. You have another month or so before Sumter's fired on. You want to take that down. No point in bankrupting ourselves. Earlier than what is need to be. So we're surely going to bankrupt ourselves. 
speech delivered in Savannah. I want to see how much positive we can keep this. So this is our actual surplus. And I think we're also going to see if we can pull in European intervention. See if that is fixed. I know there was an issue with European intervention with the armies coming through. Okay, so Fort Sumter did surrender there. Okay. At that point, River Guard is going to march north. So we are here at the start of the war. Wait, Hampton's in charge of this one. Let's see if that stems the tide. Yeah. Joseph E. Johnston, who is the commander at this point? Uh, Beauregard. Spears Division is going to march north. Armory Northwest is under Porterfield. Armory Tennessee is under Zillicoffer. This one is going to be... Albert Sidney Johnson. Gideon Pillow. Gonna have the state militia.
So the coffer is going to have that. So that's how we'll kind of do that one. Trace will come down here. We have McCullough here. The Missouri State Guard. So I want to send McCullough up to Springfield. Sterling Price against that. He's already not in any supply, which is not helpful. Get him some supply. Neither see, so let's move Albert Sidney Johnson just a little bit. Hmm. The depot here. You got a depot at Grafton at least, so there's that. At Richmond, I'm gonna get a depot going. No, I'm not. That's a march up north. South Carolina squadron is gonna go into the river. Same thing with the James River squadron. There's not one at Charleston. The one in Savannah is going to go up the river. The other fleets. Not one at Mobile. There is one at New Orleans. That's going to hold there. Isn't there another one? No, it's in 1862. The other one's over here at Galveston. Okay. It kind of gives us that. Okay. So under Lee, we'll have Yule, David Jones, Hampton. Who do I want to lead this? Not Donaldson. Uh, Cheatham, no. WHT Walker, no. Braxton Bratt, <coughs> no. Who was the other one that was out here? Oh, a lot of a lot of younger guys. So if that's the case, the so Yule was here. Who took over Yule's division? I am so blanking. There's AP Hill. Because Yule eventually becomes a division commander. God, it's been so long since I did uh, a Confederate campaign. There's a certain way I like, I, I want to compare this to. I'm going to have to look, uh, refer back to, I like my Google Drive and look, see how I set this up. So 100% set it up in a way that, that makes sense. At least in my head. I don't have it. Okay, I have it in front of me now. Okay, so it becomes. Uh, 
What? Albert Cindy Johnson takes over that, but that become what? Oh, okay, okay. You'll there's long straight. We gotta put the man, the myth, the legend on here. He's a major right now. That'll work. So we'll put Longstreet. White Hampton here. And I do need one. Wait, what? That's weird. Okay, I kind of messed that up. Under. Loring. No. Infantry. Want Bragg's going out uh, to Tennessee. Wanting to have that. Okay. This is Lee. This is Longstreet. Okay, there we go. So it pulls that. I do want one more. I want a cavalry um, position out of Virginia. Stewart's already out, out on the field, is he not? Stewart should be out in the Army of the Shenandoah. What? Oh. Hold on. Jeez. There's DH Hill, Hood. Porterfield. McCullough. Here's Johnson J okay, here's Jeb. So Jeb's already out on the on the case. In Hampton's division, I'm gonna keep Magruder here. That's such a small force. The army of the Shenandoah. So give me the army, thank you. I'll keep it such a small force as well. Where's, where's Magruder? I want to change Magruder. As DH Hill. I want to put AP Hill in charge of this. AP Hill has this. That's because I'm going to get an army in Arkansas up. No, I'm not. I mean, Tennessee. Okay, let's kind of look at this now. We have Pillow here with Preston Smith. Let's add 
more Tennessee boys into this. A couple more. Walton. Walton is fine. And Tennessee, we're not going to have Loring. That would just be silly. Richard Anderson. Tennessee is going to be 4,000. That's fine. Okay, Beauregard. You'll have that. Don't want Donaldson in charge of this. Magruder is going to go out west. Was Braxton Bragg? It was Simon Buckner? Little Hardy. Oops. That means I'm going to pull in someone with experience. I'll pick it. A Barksdale. Barksdale will work. Florida State Militia. Hampton. I'm in the Northwest. What's I'm in the Shenandoah. Let's get uh, a couple more units here from Virginia. We have Pickett in there. Um, let's go South Carolina and I'm a, and some artillery. Early? Yeah, so who commands the unit? If I'm not mistaken, it ends up being Pickett. It's Pickett's core. No, it's Yule's core, Pickett's division. I think. Or it's after, uh, I've, I've played too much. I've played too much. I've confused myself. I'm going to do this early. I normally don't. Uh, Florida. Florida doesn't have an honor man. What about uh, Georgia does?
full quit here. Reigns. I want Lorraine to be the core commander. Or uh, the division commander. So this is the Department of Richmond. Um, where is he? Marty. Dave Anderson. That's how we're going to kind of do this right now. His pillow is going to be the one that is in here. Bragg's going to be a different. Uh, Bragg's going to take the core. Johnston becomes the army commander. And then. Let's say Donaldson also becomes a core commander. And Cheatham will be the division under him. Who takes over? Bragg takes over as. Yeah, okay. That works. What's the. Who becomes the other one? Simon Buckner becomes the other one. Okay. It works for me there. Under Bucker Buckner, WHT Walker. Okay. That's good. Oh, last, I'm going to put just Magruder out here anyway. Because until they get close, you aren't going to rock the boat. Florida State Militia is preparing siege down here. Not a lot of men. We should be able to take that. Keyword is should. Nope. Florida State Militia means more, well, more militia. Okay. Whoa, what is that surplus? Ouch. Okay, we're gonna have to print notes.
like Buford there. Let's go Huger. Buford's going to go there. Where is... So Van Dorn's going to come out here already. Under McCullough. Okay, and let's come out with another army. I'm having a glitch here. Oh, it's because I had that selected. The glitch, operator error. Oh, you got it close. To me, East Tennessee under Kirby. Let James Withers be in command of it, and I'm going to put a unit from Kentucky volunteers under Bonham over here that don't want to be exploited Wait, did Harney literally attack me in a withdrawal? Where do you withdraw to? The south?
Hmm. Very strange to say the least. Okay, so they're reinforcement. That works. Just want to kind of see, observe the Union at this point. So this did uh, happen again at the war start. I'm not seeing anything strange at us. Price is withdrawing because he didn't have supply. Makes sense. There's McClellan out here. We don't have five thousand, ten thousand. So they did actually over here. They're concentrating this, so we need to withdraw. This makes, okay. The AI is being a lot better out west for the Union. Cooper's gonna take that. Okay, I'm slightly impressed.
I'm definitely not gonna crown him yet. Because we kind of held off on building a lot out west until I had an idea of what we we're looking at. Transfer. East Tennessee, where is it? Western Army under McCullough. Van Dorn. Come in here, McCullough. It's going to take. This one. And then we're going to look at some more out here with Missouri. Can't get a second one here. Can't out here though. What? Oh, that's Henry McCullough. Okay. Pike's already used. Uh, let's put on their hand, uh, Henry McCullough. That works. Eleven thousand. ETA four days, even though they're right next to them. Okay. Sounds legit. Emma Kirby Smith's going to hold here. Actually, we need we need to go right here so we block this ferry route. Union's calling for volunteers. I'm gonna go Union too, or I'm gonna go military too. Going into it, but I'm gonna go ahead and leave this episode here. We have already Militia Act One. Uh, I think this is the change. There used to be four here. There's three now. So I wonder if this Militia Act 1 that used to be here is integrated into Military Act 1. Maybe that is a fact, but that's one change that is there that I've seen in the tree, at least, the Confederates. So they start with one year at Militia Act 1. So thank you all for joining me. Go ahead and leave a like below, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Later.